Hello and welcome back to the Grog Hoarders. It is me, it is Paddy, and we're back for another episode of the Chronicles of Heart and Hammer with me and the one, the only, Jacob, who is currently holding his big stick that was once my big stick. Ah, uh, you've been demoted, but I must remind you, the name is not Jacob, it is Vinda. The big Evan stick, Evanhart. <laughs> yeah, that's an another acceptable well, name. Jacob, clearly, well, since you're holding that big stick, clearly you are compensating. For something. Are we really gonna have this conversation again? Oh, I'll tell yes, you what. we will. Do we need to do a comparison? What? Compare the lengths. Yeah, I think we do. Alright, when are we doing that? No, let's do it now. Alright. Uh, you actually wanna do that? Sure, fuck it. <laughs> because we can do this on camera and not get in trouble. Oh, we totally can. <laughs> Hang on. How do I... How do I hide the underwear? Just take it off. Right. <laughs> Shall I get a tape measure or do you want to do it? Uh, Look, mine's, you. mine's more wiggly than yours. Is that oh. so? Hello, Fresh! <laughs> They're literally the same length. No, I think mine They are is, the same length. Mine is slightly bigger. Like I don't buy that. By, by, by inches, Jake. Now we're talking inches here. Let me That's put, not even an inch let me difference put, at all. Let, let me put a centimeter, perhaps. Back on again. Now, I'll tell you what. Don't worry. This of all will accept you either way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair <laughs> enough. <laughs> <coughs> I'm sure he would you know, hey? welcome you with open arms. Hey? You know, Thizzable. Oh, Thizzable? Oh, right Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, he certainly has a big hole. Oh, Why did ignore we... that. Oh, okay, that was an accident. There we go. Hi, Fresh. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, Jacob, you're going to have to remind me because it has been so long since we have played Tuesday. We played on Tuesday, but I I can't remember. Uh, I can't remember a, lot of a goddamn things. thing on, on Tuesday. All I know is we defeated the sin of greed and the sin of gluttony. I mean, they weren't called sins, but yeah. No, they weren't called sins, but I'm gonna call it the sin of greed and the sin, sin and of honestly, gluttony. And honestly, that's, that's the main was. highlight of the stream. Yeah, we killed this Oh, I got a key. And uh, G something. Form. And we also found. Oh, there's a key right here. Ooh. I don't know why. Hey, you need the outhouse? Yeah, I, I need a shit. Can this guy hurry up? He seems to uh, have. Uh, he seems to have really. Um... <laughs> you can actually sit on it too. Can you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, here. I'm not sure why. There we go. I'll just be a minute, Jacob. Oh, we also. I've got a freaking bony flipping needed... skull up my arse, but it works. We also talked to a fellow who needed to get a letter to prove the death or the killings of murder. That's right. We need to, to stand them on trial. And They're we... undead, mind you, but he needed the ledger, and we got the ledger here at the tavern. That's right. Actually. We did. And that's where we defeated, defeated Thistleball, the flipping gluttonous, or whatever the fuck you call it. Uh -huh. And that's apparently Thistleball was also key. trying to make a uh, rather potent poison of some kind using oh. some purple worm toxin. Oh, he just made us th thrown. That was the guy who flipping got stabbed by his own nurses, wasn't it? Ah, uh, yes, yes. Why, why the fuck are we back here, Jacob? Ah, uh, I just decided I'd take a peek around, you know. I we don't. haven't actually explored this little corner. That's actually true, we haven't. Anything of any interest in here? I don't think so. Did all four of us just fail a survivor check? Yeah. That doesn't bode well. Oh, did you ever read through that one book back down there in the tavern? No, which one? Oh! Oh, we're dead! We're dead! 
I think you forgot to save it if so, because it was a, meant to be a marker board right here. I'm pretty sure. Oh, like, well, at this building I just walked up to. Right, back to the tavern. I mean, you can head back down there. I can wait up here, or vice versa. I don't care. Yep. Oh! What, what the, the hell? Fuck? Who? Who failed to kill me? Um. You know, that's a good question. But there's uh, a whole bunch of fucking Griff Yankee here, and they're veterans. Yankee ve Oh, fuck. Hang on. What? Yeah. Oh, for this is a. This is a frickin' ambush, isn't it? Yeah. Close ranks. And I don't have any rages left. At the moment. Carlac does. That's good for Carlac. Um. Let me see. That's that's right. I'll... Oh! You just... Right, yeah. Oh my god, Charged. where the... So if someone here, okay. I see that now. We're... I just realized we're very weak as well. Us? Yeah. Look, you're flipping three quarters of your health down. Um... Yeah, Shadowheart's nearly we dead. We weren't prepared for this. I really just needed to like heal some people. I think we actually needed a long rest at the end of that stream, but that's beside the point. Oh yeah, we did, didn't we? We'll get through this fight. Oh, we will. We always do. Usually. Oh! Ho -ho! Hmm. So this was an ambush because we made enemies of the Githyanki. Essentially. Right. Pesh. I mean, I think we're gonna make enemies with them no matter what, though, being honest. They are our souls, though. Yeah, I was but, gonna say, I don't even know if there's a natural way to get them on our side. But that old like, guy's on our side, though. Oh, maybe he's the only sensible one. Well, I'm getting three of us in this. Karlak won't be in it, but... That's okay, Karlak isn't too damaged. She would have been in it if she didn't get bloody pushed back. For God's sake, stop attacking Karlak! Yeah, yeah. You, you don't like it when I do it to you, do you? You bitch. Go on. Reckless attack. Let's be finished with you. Oh, you missed. Fuck's sake, Carla. Come on. This person up here, Shokari is the second, has 127 fucking health. Woohoo! Schmite! That did fuck all. What the fuck? I think it's a crossbow. That was an arrow of many targets. It ricocheted between three of us. Oh, I don't like the one of that. Ow. Ooh. I hope this isn't going to be a thing now where we're just going to constantly get bombarded with Gith Yankee bastards. I hope not. Mm. Well done, Jacob. Thank you. I don't know what you did, but well done. What did you do? 
I used the scroll. I cast oh, the scroll to it. Okay. Shield blue. Die. Uh. Yeah, I'm about to go down here, I think. Oh! Yep. oh. Suppose you can get Shadowheart to heal you? Shadowheart doesn't exactly have that many healing things left at the moment, actually. Shit. Yeah. Oh my gosh, she only has one level, one spell slot after this. You're gonna have to really do some serious damage when you get up here, because uh, me and Shadowheart are both tapped on resources. Once I kill this guy right here, I'll make my way up to you. Right. Mess! These guys are fucking strong. Missed again! Never a dull moment. Critical hit! Thank God for that. Bye. Right, I'm on my way to you. Thank you, thank you. And we need a long rest after this for sure. Oh, we totally do. <gasps> oh, Jacob. There we go. Just try your best to survive, Jacob. I'm gonna miss the step up behind them. If I can. That'll be good. I might be out of I might be out of slots for that actually, but uh, I'm gonna use some scrolls. What's this? I'm gonna see if I can blind her. Damn it! Didn't work? No, not at all. Shit. So, yeah, Shadowhood's probably about to go down here. That's okay. Oh, oh, you're okay. You're okay. Aye, aye. Here I come. Well, no, not quite. <laughs> right, do I have Misty Step? There we go. That was some good damage in there. Do I have Misty Step? 
I don't have Misty step. Sorry, Jacob. It's all right. We won't have to sprint. Carl, I should be able to help finish us off here. Actually, I might be able to. Please tell me I have a... Oh, now I've got bloody Misty step. For fuck's sake. Must have been too far. Yeah. Oh, it's your turn still, so. I'm just seeing if I can do anything, Jacob. I don't think I can. Don't have any actions or anything? Oh, yeah. this person's a fucking avatar of Lacket. AKA, she's like. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Really? Yeah, we haven't even hit that one. <laughs> well, she missed all her turns. Go get her, Jacob. What do? She dead? Just about. Alright, I should be able to shank her in the back here. Scratch that. Here we go. She dead? Yeah, I got her. Very well. Do I have no I don't? Right, Jacob. That was a very close one. To say the least. Also, apparently, Voss had given us a psionic detector or some shit. Which... Apparently did actually alert us to that ambush coming up. Oh really? Yeah! Well, it took me by surprise. Oh, it did mention something to me about a Gith Yankee ambush, but I didn't know where it was. Okay, fair enough. So. Ugh, that flippin' grotesque monster. Jesus. And there's grog all over the place as well. Sounds like it's my frickin' wet dream. Anyway, um. Mm. Right, let me read this book. I'm gonna have a long rest. Research. Oh. He procured visible devoted months to formulating a deadly poison with the remaining ingredients. Wait, so he wanted Without to form a deadly success. poison, we've, we've got that. After exhaustive experimentation, he was able to make a near deadly extract from the glands. But to complete his poison, Thisbald required one last ingredient the petals of a corpse rose. The book's index reveals corpse roses may grow near tombs. Mausoleum. Petals of a corpse rose when it and cadavers. There's a yes. listed a courier from Baldur's Gate. Did you go back and read that one book I take it? Then, other I'm reading the book as we speak. And deliver them to a covert location. Unfortunately, right. a deep purple stain darkens the final page. 
obscuring the parcel's destination. Focus your eyes on the page. Right, here's something I can do this this time. 19, yes! There you go. There we go. God, I'm good. Your mind separates the black from the blue, revealing the stash's location. You mark your map as a reminder. With the corpse rose petals the package contains, you might create Visible's purple worm poison. And I suppose this purple worm poison will uh, be potent as fuck. And will help us in massacring Moonrise Towers? You know, I don't see why not. Because we are, we are going yes. to give them the Goblin Camp treatment, aren't we? We are, we are going to. Oh yeah, we're totally definitely going to kill them. It's just a matter of how long do we want to quote unquote infiltrate before we do. Yeah. Oh, we we're definitely going to infiltrate, and we're going to flipping. Infiltrate. I found the dirt man, by the way. Oh sweet. Yeah, no, Corpse we're rules. we're going to infiltrate. Cloud giant finger, frost alamander tongue, wyvern stinger, swimming toad store. We call we, record of the shipment. We are definitely going to infiltrate the fuck out of Moonrise. Yeah, alright. Right. So. I need to make some salt of corpse rose. Are we going back to long rest here? I just made this world's brewed up belly glamour. Did you? Yep, you I crafted it. Can you make me a dose as well? A, a dosage as well? I can only make one dosage by the looks of it. Oh. Yeah. We'll be all right though, I'm sure. Aye. Right, that's a long rest. That sounds like a good idea. Right, so, Lizelle, I'm talking to you, love. We must press forward. Let's deal with Kethrick, then find Voss in Baldur's Gate. Okay. Lizelle's not angry. Ah. Where's Carlac? See if she has anything to say. Hey. Um. Uh, Go on. I'm gonna kiss. I'm gonna kiss her. Are you happy with how things are between us? If you're happy, I'm happy. I'm happy. Are you happy? Couldn't have said it better myself. I'm deliriously happy. Can I kiss you? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Mm. <laughs> All right. Sorry, I'm just. Oh, you having your fun over there? Oh, I'm I'm having great fun. No. Sure. Let's go to bed. There we go. And are we going to have a decent night's sleep, I wonder? One can hope. Yes, we are. We haven't been interrupted in a while. It's true. Oh, oh shit. Has something it is there. as we knew. My people have turned their blades against us. They yeah. will emerge from the shadows and descend from the skies. Yeah. And we will grant them their only just <laughs> Yeah, fate. that might have been our fault, death. Jacob. Yeah, she just oh, okay, she just has sworn death on her gift Yankee um, people. people. But that's it. No no one else has anything good to say. 
I'm sure it'll be all right. So uh, let's leave. Hey, sure. Let's leave and make our way over to the gentleman who is going to judge the dead body because that is not weird. Where are you? No. I'm still back this way. Oh, that's right. I went to camp over here. Um, hang on. Wait for me. I'm coming up to you. There's a bit of an overlook here though, it seems. With a survival? Not another ambush, is it? No, don't mound. <coughs> Why was it a survival check, though? I don't know. Oh! Oh, oh! I don't know if we should... Oh, another dirt mine. close. At least it's a good overlook. Clustered fires and tents. The absolute army is camped here. Oh Jesus! Press my luck. See, even your character agrees that we shouldn't cast our luck going yeah. there. Yeah. Well, that's here, 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 Jacob, 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 Jacob. That's the route to Baldur's Gate. I guess we'll have to fight our way through there at some point. Yeah. Maybe after we dismantle the Absolute. Although, is since we're all gonna be taken down, right? I would say so, yeah. Unless, like I said, the absolute's a complete disappointment and it's actually your man Catherick Thorne that flippin' runs the show. Well, no, he'd be one of three people, I think. Yeah. Because there's like three significant people that are running the show. I I, I thought we killed them all in the uh, in the ruined temple. No, those are not the same people. Oh. Also, apparently there's a harpy's nest up on this roof. What? The roof of the House of Healing. Um, By the looks of it. Does that mean we are having to go back in there? I don't think so. We didn't get a quest for it or anything. I just... I zoomed out and it's like, oh, there's a nest with a pig's head in it and a skeleton. Dedicated to Rondle Peak, stonemason. Never missed a day's work due to illness. Barring his last. Um... I don't think it's important though. It doesn't look like there's no. anything notable up there. So. Well, that's inside the House of Healing. Do we really yeah, want to go and re do we really want to go and relive to go those memories again? I don't think we need to. No. Yeah. Thank God. Right now we have to go over. We we need to go over to your man and deliver the yeah. the, the ledger and see what happens is there. Oh, wait. That's way up north. Do you want to walk all the way there? I don't mind. What do you think? It'll be quite the walk, if so, I think. Um, the looks of it. Uh, I don't mind. Yeah, let's walk there. Alright. Because, um, I mean, we've got all... We, I, we've got all night. So, the night is Fair still enough. young. Walk we shall. I'll just presume you know the way, because I do not. No, I don't know either. I'm just sort of following the general uh, direction of the... Well, here's the tool house. This is where we... Um... So if we go past that... Yeah, hang on a wee minute here. Hang on, hang on, Jacob. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I think it's this way. No, there's a gateway right here. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, shit! Yeah, I, I messed it. <laughs> I got wait for me. <laughs> also, I just noticed I'm really far away from you. You are fine, still. Yeah. I'm not sure what that is. I don't know. I'm not complaining though. No, no, absolutely not. Um. Since I started this conversation with this guy, can I be the one to finish it? Sure, I don't mind. Thank you muchness. I'm just sort of assuming that you knew the way, you. since you've got the big stick. I, I'm just kind of winging it, but if I we can get way back, way. if we can find our way back to last light. Uh, 
Uh, we're not near go the last site to get there. I'm on the way. We're nearly there at the moment, actually. Oh, where we are, actually. Hmm. Um. I guess that's why, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I thought there might be a connecting path here, but there's not. Looks like we are on our way to last light. No, we didn't skip over the last light. Just did a bit of a jump here. And down over here. Then it was up here, wasn't it? Yep. This way. Oh, bugger, it is this way. God, this place is confusing. Indeed. Oh, there's some dead helpers up here. Hey, did we not kill them? No, not... No, helpers are the allies. Oh, sorry, I think they're you said harpies. No, helpers. Right. Here we go. The air stirs in trepidation. You have the ledger. I'll hold until you're less than in, Jacob. Thank you. Oh, there he is. Good on for flipping real time cutscenes. Is that you? Uh huh. Um. Shit, right, do we want to inquire? Tell me why you want it first, or should we just give it to him? I mean, we already know. Yeah, he too. wanted to. Oh, you know, they'll say they hear it. Her lies, her guilt. Madeline reported her friends to a dark justicia, and fled when they were butchered. Well, she flees no more. I will be the conduit for Madeline's spirit. I will force her to face trial. Oh. And you will be the judge. Make her beg. Make her We'll suffer. be the, wait, we're gonna be the judge? So, sounds like we're about to fight him actually once he does this. Um, but... When punishment is needed, my hand will not shy from the blades. The Raven was right. We were fated to meet. Break her, my friend. Most why does it sound like we're about to kill this guy? I, I don't know. Why does he sound like he's getting sexual pleasure from this? He's not, but it's a... <laughs> Break her! It sounds like he's sort of got a, a rumpy pump here. I mean, he seems like a... Oh, this is odd. Yep, he is definitely climaxing. You. <coughs> he said I was going to be punished. That you'd be the judge. But I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Why don't you tell me what happened? It didn't mean nothing. That Ben and Mark were just drunk and whining. The Dark Justicia promised she was going to chat with him. She promised. What did the Dark Justiciar actually do to your friends? She gave him a dagger each and told him to press it against their stomachs on the count of three to start stabbing and not stop till she said so. She never said stop. I'd do anything to take it back. Anything. Anything then hurt yourself as Ben and Mark did mm. stab yourself? Oh. Pathetic, you murdered your friends, you're a card. There's nothing you need to do. This wasn't your fault, I promise. What should we do? It depends how forgiving you want to be. Well, Jacob, I am all for flipping do unto others as you would do yourself, or an eye for an eye. I would nearly make her stab herself. Oh, I think if you're going the route of actually trying to get quote unquote justice from this, options are definitely going to be one or two. Yeah, I think justice. I mean, 
I think this guy would kill us if he, uh... I would say at least number two, if not one. Because the thing is, if we do one, the guy might die in the process. Oh, shit! I'm guessing that. Yeah, that's right. Pathetic. But you apparently that's friends. what he wants. Wait, he wants to be killed? Well, he said, do not stay your blade or something along the lines of that when it came to punishing you. So, I have no idea. Two is the safe bet, I think, but one might be the quote-unquote more just thing in his eyes. Shall we do one then? I have, I have no fucking idea. We'll do one. You're gonna have to persuade her either way. Oh, I'm gonna pass this. Oh, pesh. <laughs> <laughs> you tried. P peshy, but pesh, pesh. Can I reroll? No, I can't. Pesh. with grief. The connection begins to fade. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ben. I'm sorry, Mark. I'm so... <sighs> oh, wow. Ah, oh, pity. She fades. Her pain was such that even I could not tether her for long. Still, her grief was most potent. It will satiate me for a time. Um, she was punished. That's all that matters. If you are satisfied, then so am I. You did not harm her as much as I had hoped, but your work was adequate, as will be your reward. Here, for your services, should I find another murderer in need of torment, I shall call upon you. Thank you. Farewell. What did we get? 27 gold. That's it. And a pair of gloves. What are the pair of gloves? Um, I'll accept it and have a look in my... Um, ah, there they are there. Raven gloves. Um, summon Quoth the Raven. Oh! Dark and suitably moody. These gloves are perfect for wearing while thinking about poetry. It summons Quoth. It summons the Raven. Do you mind if I take them? Because I don't have a summon yet. I mean, it's going to replace whatever you're wearing for gloves right now. Uh, gloves of the I Growling mean, Underdog. Take it. And is... the Growling Underdog's gloves do what again? Um, underdogs bravery, the wearer gains advantage in melee attack rolls. Under what conditions? Um, while surrounded by two or more foes. It's not bad. It's not bad. Although, this will give me a summon, so... I mean... I mean, having a summon isn't a bad thing, but I'm not sure how much use it will prove. I'll Maybe it'll it be good. I'll give it a go, and if it's not good, then I'll switch it back again. Um, Fair enough. Right, anyway. Where's Carlac? Oh, uh... Separated from you, apparently. She's all the way back down near the last light in. Oh, right, well, I'll, I'm just going to teleport. I'm going to fast travel her. I guess she got caught up on her. Let's just go down to the tour <coughs> house, or the waning moon areas. Actually, no, Rathwind time would be the fa closest fast travel. So, is this, is this it? Where... I think so. Um, we'll go south and uh, make a little introduction, so to say. Where are we going? Towards Moon Eyes Towers. Okay. Keep in mind, we can stay undercover for as long as we want. Maybe That's we can true. do some shopping while we're there or something, I don't know. That's true. Here, is there anything in this little town that we can explore still? Or is it sort of, I don't Nothing just... that I know of, because we've been in the Toll House, we've been in the Winning Moon, we've been to the Mason's Guild, the House of Healing. We haven't done the Grand Mausoleum yet, although I have a feeling we might want to do that after we visit Moon Eyes. Yeah, I That agree. way we can get a little bit more context. I agree. Because it's all about Catherick Thorne. And I have a feeling if we go in there, that's going to be like a really big thing for the plot. Okay. 
Same with if we tried to get, take the road to Baldur's Gate right now. I probably can't, well, that, and also that, if we did, we'd act be leaving three. everything here behind. Yeah, that'll start Act 3. We'll yeah. Get that. We're close. We've barely started Act I would act definitely two. save it. Feel it. Yeah. Right. The absolute. We're close. Right. The absolute. Uh, before we go in, Jacob. His power is strong here. We have to do it. You ready? I. Certainty of death. Certainty of death. Small chance of Small success. Chance of success. What the hell are the we waiting hell for? What are we waiting for? Let's go. Oh. Well, it's saving. Oh, I think I might be able to put this in entry right now. I think you can. Finally. Oh, what are these guards? That's far enough. Jesus. Are you in a cutscene? I'm in a cutscene with the guards. His thoughts invade your own, probing for purchase. Your parasite purrs in recognition. Ah, one blessed like myself. What news, true soul? Mm. We still think that we're true souls. Great news! Yeah, I'm here to take your way. head. No. <laughs> Little from the Not field. Yet. What news inside? I might ask the same. Why is one of our rank uh, uh, of guard duty? Um, that's for your superiors to know. I've infiltrated an encampment of Harpers protected by a cleric of Saloon. Anything? What do you think? Hmm. I think if we were going the evil route, number four would be the way to go. Okay. But, I don't think we're doing evil per se, we're just trying to be undercover. So, so one? Maybe either one, two, or three. One. General Ketherick's advisor went off on a field trip. Zarel's in charge till he gets back. Zarel's in charge, in the okay. audience chamber, true soul. She'll be wanting to hear from you. That's what I call an invitation. Let's find Zarel and get this caravan moving. Yes, let's go find Zarel. Um, what? Wait, what's this? Let's find Zarel. Oh, in her name or leave. One of the two. In her name. Absolute. Okay. Yeah, in her name, I think is a way to make sure. We're... Oh, don't go up the steps yet. Let's look around the outside first. Oh if you want. shit! It's the right sides. Yeah, it looks like there's some undead. Oh. What are these fellows over here? Ghouls! Oh. And talk to them. There is only the absolute. Jesus. Oh my god, it's right. barely alive by most standards. And still it bows to the Welcome absolute. Welcome back, Fresh. Uh, <laughs> weird. Right, we can definitely jump over that. I really like how creepy they are. I know, right? Oh, here, here's a door. Oh, uh, what is this, a back way in, probably? Is this a back way in? That'd be my guess. Well, we want to go through the main doors if we don't want to look inconspicuous, right? Well, we can open it. It's not, like, tra teleporting us. Oh! There can be no doubt. This is the place. This is where we'll discover the secret of the absolute. Yeah, this is this Tomalia. is the back way in. Hello. I can't talk to her. No. I guess they can't talk on her to Domini as well. Why are we floating? Timothy. You know what? I'm not gonna question this. Yeah, shall we um leave and go oh, through the main no, doors? No, no. I mean we could actually, sure. Yeah. Just, just to get things. Oh, this just is very to get clearly. like a moonrise. Yeah, we're going the back way, and we should probably go for the grander entrance rather yeah. than going through it in this. We are true souls, Jacob. Um, is there anything around the other side, or is it much the same? There's another goal here. Uh, I think that's a dead end. Mm. 
Looks like it is, yeah. Right. Let's Unless you had the ability to fly. Let's go in. Well, Jacob. All right. The here goes nothing. Entrance. Ooh. Interesting interior. Another true song. The disciple. Let's not go to the main doors yet. Because no. that's going to be the cutscene. Lan Tar has quite the mustache here. Ah, a new face come to bask in the light of the absolute. How can I be of service, true soul? Uh, new face we met before at the Goblin Camp. Hmm. I'm not. I'm not going to mention the Goblin Camp. Probably a good idea not to. Yeah. Right, let's browse her wares, see if she has anything interesting. Um, okay, a few things. Um, a few fire arrows and stuff. Um, what's this? Ice arrow, 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 arrow. She's got a lot of arrows. Plate armor, plus one. That's pretty damn good. That's 19 AC flat. Add a shield on. That's twenty one AC. Are you watching this? Are you are you in this menu? Oh, as well? I was in the I was in a shop actually. Oh, I'm in a shop. What's too. going on over there? Oh, you're in a different shop then. Thieves' tools. I'll get some of them. And a trap disarm kit. That'll never hurt anyone. Uh, we've got battle axe, a bow of awareness. No. Ooh. The Halberd of Vigilance. Gain a plus one bonus to initiative rolls and advantage on the perception ability checks. When you make an attack roll as a reaction, you make it with advantage. Hmm. Um, okay. Um, I found something. And what's that? The Drake Throat Glaive. Um, what does that do? Might, um, 6 to 15 damage, 1d10 plus 5 slashing, draconic elemental weapon, level 3, transmutation spell, um, proficiency with the, this weapon unlocks, I don't know what spells they are, um, yeah. I want to come give that a look in just a moment, but uh... Might do good for me, because it's more it's more powerful than Valor Aloof. As I said, I'll give that a look here in just a moment, but Gold it does sound wormling. pretty useful. Gold Wormling Staff. 6 to 16 damage, 1d8, 1d6 plus 4, bludgeoning. Hmm. Um... Well, I just bought an armor upgrade, actually. Oh! The Enraging Hot Garb. Which boosts my uh, HP total a little bit. Oh, here, there's a few, um... There's a few armors here as well that you might like the look of. Oh, I just got this one, but I'll give them a quick glance. Um... Oh. oh! I do remember her. She's a Zentura An person. True so. Yeah. Um, right. You might want to go talk to the other merchant real quick. I, I'll go, I'm going to go talk to this other merchant as well. Have a look at that one. That, that's Glaive so that I tell looked at. She said you'd find me at here. Uh, well. Sharpened Snare God. Cure. It? And your full dexterity modifier to your armor what was class. That's Didn't amazing. Quiz her about her business. That can be up to 19 fucking AC. Holy shit. Oh, wait, what? Carlock? Who's Flo? Florenta the Garotta. Shopping to make creatures out to smash us and things from resisting your attacks and spells. She was the closest thing I had to a friend. That said, she would have chosen the life out of the fire and turned my back on her. Hmm. 
The fact that she knows where I am, where I might be going, doesn't exactly delight me. Okay, Carlac is worried. There's, um, I think there's a threat after. Maybe. Uh oh. Probably. Girl Flo. She's a Floretta or something. Impossible to read. And who the fuck is Floretta? Oh, she knew. She knew her back in Avernus. And I think she's following him. What can I say? Her. The bitch had good jokes. Enough. What chatter. the fuck does that mean? Your friend gave me three soul coins. Said I could sell them if I wanted. But if I kept them for you. Alright, the Drake Soul Glaive is a bad. Oh, three soul, soul coins. coins huh? What? This could come in handy. Let's have the soul coins then. Hmm. Wait, hang on. Whoa, hang on, hang on. This guy has that flu is a devil who gives soul coins to this merchant to give to Carlac. What? And said uh, uh, Carlac says the soul coins could come in handy. But then I have an option saying we shouldn't take anything offered by a devil, it's too risky. Ah, oh, that's your call. We'll have the soul coins and see what. Sure. But she did have a condition. Oh, she had a condition, of course. For every she did. coin you take, you've got to hear the story of the soul trapped inside. We have to hear yeah, the story of the flu it. trapped inside. The soul trapped inside. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Clever use of our time. Memorized a bunch of sad stories on her behalf, did you? Oh, Jesus. Didn't need to. Your flow did some devil woo-woo and stuck him in my head. Couldn't forget now if I wanted to. You want the coins or not? Right, so... Um... If we accept these coins, she's going to give the co... Um... F uh, apparently this devil flow is going uh, uh, his, um, going to give the souls the coins to Carlac, which are apparently they're they're very they're very um that they're they're expensive items. Um, however, the catch uh -huh. is she has to listen. If she wants the coins, she has to listen to the souls that are inside it. Listen to right. the stories of the souls that are inside it. So yeah, let's go on with it. What's the worst that can happen? First coins got the soul of a woman named Mavery. First coin. Are you listening to this? To a cruel mother, um, and a violent father, and three. I found another merchant that I was actually going to talk to very quickly. She never knew a day of love. In Just to see what life. they have. When she was a girl of fifteen, she sold her soul to Tiamat. Looks more like a wizard merchant, not also though. Unconditionally. Okay, this guy's she telling us the stories of these coins. A fellow oh. named Clint. Destined to be her soulmate, struck by a cart mm. and died a few moments after clapping eyes on our Mavery. Poor guy, the scud of her soul is yours now. Thanks, I guess. We'll put that coin to better use than time out would have. <laughs> sure you will. This one has got the soul of a man named Frakes. Okay. Lived in a village near. Never winter. Hit hard by the worst hunger in a thousand years. Frakes called out for help. Prayed for his children to have meat to eat. Zariel answered. Made old Frakes grow flesh upon flesh after flesh. His wee ones had all the meat they could stomach. He should have known. Better to die a thousand deaths than let Zariel into your life. We'll put that coin to good use. He'll help us rid of the realms of people like Zariel. <laughs> Whatever you need to tell yourself. Last one's got the soul of a little boy named Ongear. Oh, a little Eight boy, no. He liked playing in the sun. A little boy, friends. That's all I know. That's all? That's all. Oh, and this slip of scratch. Well, thanks, Flo. Hearing a bunch of desperate horror has ruined my day, which I suppose was the point. You got three soul coins out of the bargain, didn't you? I'd quit whinging if I were you. I did my part. That means our business is done. 
unless you've got actual gold to hand. Let me see your wares. Hey, loads of arrows. Hmm. Well, I recolored my gear. Now, just for the hell of it. Nothing too interesting. Hope you can handle what I've got. Right. Where are you, Jacob? I did. I've I've just been forced to listen to several depressing stories, so please say something to cheer me up. I saw a chew toy for sale. Oh, where? Yeah, I'll, I'll buy it real quick. Can I chew it? Just stand. All right. It oh, it is. Yeah. It is big boy's shoe toy. Here, jump me to buy it. Uh, you don't have to. It's eight hundred and six fucking gold, man. Jesus, no, let's buy it. I mean, I've got loads. I mean, if you want to. Yeah, I'll, bu I'll buy it. I think the dog deserves a treat, or the oil bear. Hmm. Oh God, we might have to choose who gets it—the dog or the oil bear. Yeah. Man, who do you think would be more fitting for it? I'm not too sure. Maybe it's just the dog, though. Where do you hail? <sighs> right. My brothers have the dreams, too. Same as me. They wouldn't admit it. We're in the belly of the beast now. Try not to do anything too um, heroic. If you have coin, then show me. So where's the cheat toy? It's for sale on there. In a uh, uh, Dan Lockfellas. Am I at the right guy? It's the bug player. That's all I got. Aye. Am I being really silly? It's near the top right. Oh, big boy's chew toy. Yep. It's a weapon. And it also has a level 2 spell on it to summon things. Lovely. Get moving, will you? Right. Shall we, uh... There's an ogre over here, apparently. Oh, really? Oh, by the way, speaking Make. of ogres, we still have, um... I still have that horn. To summon it a second time. To summon... Maybe, maybe that would be good for... Hmm... For a moment, you do... <laughs> when we get in a big fight here, definitely. Sliding on oh, stone. totally. Like a living being extending. Apparently, the there's some kind of flesh moving around inside the walls. The oh. ogre can hear it, and I can too. Oh. Something in the walls? What is it? In walls it's the unknown! Maybe. Apparently, it might be throughout the whole tower. Near kitchen. But Apparently, the it's the loudest near the kitchen. Well, I think that calls for us knows. to investigate. You just got a thing to investigate it for? You find meat? She just said you find meat, you share. <laughs> right. Remind me, did we kill that bugbear and ogre that were fornicating back in Act 1? We did, yeah. Ah. Uh, hold on. Is this? Is this something? Well, why did you get up there? I just jumped. I was trying to see if there was anything up here, but there's nothing. I don't even know why it's a thing. Oh. Yeah. This is the spot that's marked on that map. Oh! What? This wall here needs to be broken down, apparently. 
It's a cracked wall. Well, what are we waiting for? Well, it's immune to piercing oh. damage. So, do you got some bludgeoning damage at all, Sam? I've got slashing damage. Uh, Shadowhunt might be able to do some bludgeoning here. It's got to be bludgeoning to break it. Slashing stone doesn't work well. And then there's a the loot chest in there. 75 gold, two pads, poison resistance, and oil, oil of bane. bane. Lovely. We'll have to wait. I can't talk right now. I think we should go check out that kitchen before we go do any big cutscene. Yeah, I agree. Now, I don't know if we're gonna find anything, mind you, but. I tell you, this is the way to the kitchen. What the frick oh. is this? A steel claw. Eyes the parasite with a glint in her eye. Intent clear. Murder. Glorious. Okay, <laughs> we've got a homicidal cat. Um, if you want me to, I can chat with it. Yeah. Murder. Glorious murder. Glorious murder. Oh, I did not pass that. Well done, Jacob. I held up my hand. I'm gonna use my inspiration to roll again. The I pass. You, but her eyes stray to a small tunnel hidden in the wall. Oh. The message is oh. clear. Stay if you wish, but she will flee. At the moment's notice, where's the tunnel? Uh, the cat hole is up here. I'm way too big. So if we had a druid who could shapeshift, he could probably fit through there. Like Halston, but he's a bear. But he can shapeshift into anything, wall shaping wise. Not just a bear. Bear's just the best for combat. This is another cellar. Oh. So where's the kitchen? Uh, right around the corner there. What the fuck is this? What the fuck I is what? I find the flesh. Wait, you did? Yeah, it's right here. Oh. Do you think I should slash it's... it with my sword? I'm going to save. Yeah, I don't even know if you can slash it. But it's coming from up above, like the second floor, right? It won't even give me like the action, but actually like look into it or like observe it. Yeah. So that's kind of odd. Well, obviously. And we can't talk to the gnolls, but who's this Lincella? Here we go. What's <laughs> this? A moment, true soul. You trying to oh, tell the gnoll how to steal a soup. Use a spoon Get instead of an axe. Darling. Oh. I've never seen a tame gnoll before. Soft and sweet as pudding, is it? Yeah. He? No, I've never seen a tame gnoll either. In the wild. That is the gift do you remember the gnolls that we killed in the flipping yes. wilderness? Yes, I do. And one of them had a tadpole in their mind, controlling them. I, the gnoll queen. There's something better. Mm-hmm. You know, the one that you maybe get rid of the club of. Yeah. No, we don't want to say anything here that will get us something done in. Uh, Noel's will be playing simple. I thought the absolute accepted us all as we are. You've actually stood before the absolute, or I'm just going to say heartwarming. Praise, Praise her name. Praise her works. Committed by the hands of her faithful. Observe. Barnabas, sweetie, come show what a good boy you are. What would you like him to do? How about a dance? Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you, Barnabas? A dance would be nice. You feel her will surge outwards mm -hmm. and envelop the creature. 
inexorable as the tide. Fucking pardon? This is quite <laughs> dark. Yeah. No, Barnabas. We talked about this. Yes, Barnabas. Do as you're told. You know, I could sever her control right now. But that'll get us caught, will it not? I don't know. Nah, do what you want. We're saved. So if okay. we get if if we fuck up if we fuck up, I don't think I'll pass this. Oh, I'll be damned! You dead? Well done. Like rope drawn taut beneath the blade, the connection simply snaps. Now, Barnabas, Dalin. There's a parasite in that corpse. What? Rimming with potent magic. What? <laughs> he, he killed her. Right, a mind flare specimen. Uh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. So, what can we do with this mind flare specimen then? Uh, the same upgrades we normally do. Don't have to do anything now. Oh, yeah, uh, I do have to click on it. I don't think I'm going to be able to persuade him. Oh, I did! Oh, you're still I'm doing this. the bastard. He sizes you up, then turns away to easier prey. The kitchen's rich stock of unguarded meat and a warm patch by the fire. Did. Well, Does that have anything else? One cultist dine, hundreds to go. Yeah. You can't talk to them, I don't think. Oh, that's fine. So there is that lead. Or the weird music coming from upstairs. Uh, we've looked around most of the first floor, haven't we? Apart from the main absolute chamber, do you want to go and trigger I mean, that we have, thing? We haven't talked to the pilgrims over here. Oh, I. Is there anything? I don't know. The absolute herself called us here. They cannot stop us from seeing. Shall we? Uh, they can't stop us from seeing this Sister, pray with me while we wait. Shall we go and see Zarel? Is there anything else to talk to look at in here? There's some stairs with some blood with a bloody trail leading down down it. I oh, although that leads to a different uh, floor. That is the council room, the main room that we are going to go into. Yeah. I think I think we should go and do this cutscene first. What's the worst that can happen? Just to sure. introduce us to the absolute and then we'll explore the rest of the tower after. Yeah, then we'll poke around some. Aye. Anyway. Let's, let's go in. Let's do this. I did as I was told! Followed every order I was given! The facts suggest otherwise. You were ordered to retrieve the artifact. You failed to do so. Oh, shit. Take it up with me, Thora. She's the one who... Enough! A blast of mental energy washes over you, filling the room. Oh? Your tadpole squirts, hmm. urging you to obey. You failed to retrieve the artifact. You failed to protect your true soul. You do not deserve to live. Oh. Uh. Uh, I think we keep solid and we'll I keep think watching. they're goblins. I don't give a shit. You ain't serious. You can't be. General Thorn. Oh! Let oh, it's Catherine Thorn! speak. You have seen what these creatures are capable of, and you have seen their This guy's over a hundred years old, by the way. So? Which what isn't is abnormal for elves, but from what we know, we he's meant to be dead. We he's a lot less grotesque than his family. Enough. True, so well, he's not going to let himself be grotesque. 
Um, wait, what's yeah. Sister asking? Disciple Zarel enough, true soul, the tell the general how the goblins served our case. Um, the faithful soldiers who should set them free, or oh, I saw the horrors they committed in the absolute's name. Just kill them, they're worthless. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like two and three are the options that we would take if we wanted to stay undercover. Yeah, just kill them, although, they're worthless. Although two might actually out us because. I don't know what the Absolute considers a That's it. We, we don't know the manifesto the Absolute has here. You know, they could be like, M kill everyone, you know? <laughs> well, they all kill everyone who doesn't convert. Just, that just, is a manifesto. Just kill them. They're worthless, I think. It's your decision. Yeah, You're the true. talker here. We could as anyone. Just give us a chance. And there you have it. We're too close to the ending and the new beginning. I really like, like that arm. It's gorgeous. No Kill them. Is that quickly. what you're gonna wear? Oh. You're gonna give that to somebody else. No! You creaking old bag of shit! Oh? <laughs> oh, good! He's done the job for us. Great, we can go home. Doesn't work. Great, yep, yep, we're done, we're good, that's it, we're done, he's Remember, killed. <laughs> oh shit. He's meant to be un unkillable. Oh shit. I'm so sorry my lord, she's More an unbeliever told. outside my control. Uh, right. Okay. Try again. He died a hundred years ago. That's Somehow right. he's back. So he's undead. And now he doesn't Oh, control. Jesus Christ. Of Holy. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> That's fucking badass. God damn. Dispose of the rest as you see fit. Or better yet, put that true soul to use. You have far more important matters to attend to. Or have you forgotten? Of course not, my lord. Thank you. Oh. You heard the general. The goblins are yours. Deal with them however you wish. If we're keeping in the cover, either two or three. Uh. To one of those two, that would be the choice. Two or three. Nod curtly. Here in the seat of the absolute's power. Your authority over them is complete. They will obey any command. Good. Report to me upstairs when you're done. Yeah, you ain't gonna do anything drastic, are ya? We've been nothing but loyal. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hang on, hang on. Are we, are, are we deciding their fate here at the moment? Yes. Trial by combat. I don't stand a chance. Where the fuck's Karlak here? Another day, another fight. Don't fucking use a crit on them. No, I'm not. <laughs> Where's Carla? I don't know, that's what I asked you. Well, we didn't need her. Oh, I, I just picked up a note from one of them. You've got this, Racha. You're gonna be the bestest true soul there ever was. All you got to do is trust Madara, listen to the Absolute, and do as she says. Then you get your audience, and you'll be proper rewarded. Don't go listening to them fakers like Dren. Dren does not hear shit. I almost feel a little bit bad. Is that from almost. their mum? 
Don't sit on that throne if you want to live. Seat, Catherick defied gods and raised an army for so the we absolute. Right, I'll tell you what. You it see is when... not particularly comfortable. You see when we. Yeah, fight. we'll definitely sit on that when we kill him. We are totally sitting on that throne when the, when this massacre is done. So right. we are told to report upstairs after we kill them. Although I want to look in that basement. Right. Okay. Because I saw a basement off to the side that had a bloody trail leading to it. Okay. Now, hopefully we won't get in trouble going down here. We're, we're true souls, Jacob. Oh, true. We shouldn't be. There's a lot of blood coming from this way. And a lot of cages. Oh, this is a torture room. Jesus Christ. Question there, Jason. Uh, they don't have anything really important to say. Christ, mm. this place is dark. Some zealots here. Oh, well, I found the tieflings. Oh, there's tieflings in here. Right, we have to rescue them. We do. Once we, you know, not, kill everybody. We're not rescuing them yet, though. Hmm. There's a few things in here, actually. Uh, we need to look at that at some point here shortly. What? I don't. I, I want to come over here before I show it to you. See what you're looking at around here. I. Uh, these are these are just cages locked up, or things locked up in cages. Well, there might be people to talk to on some of these. Standing. I am. Oh, oh hey! Look who I found. What? What? Who did you find? Warborn Bongo. Who, who's that guy Barkus was looking for? Oh yeah. Nimble. Hello. Check for gaps, cracks, anything to leverage the rock. Nickels, tools. Get creative. This rock is basalt. It'll crack with was enough. Was he in the underdark? No, this is the guy Barkus was looking to find. Ah, gotcha. Uh. Right, well, we, we're not freeing them yet, Jacob, just saying. I know, I know. We can't talk to them, though, seemingly, unless we get permission from Balthazar. Oh, who's Balthazar? Who is the warden of this place. Right, and he doesn't sound like a fucking arse. Uh, we'll see. What's in here? The warden. Warden Balthazar? I see he's just called the Warden. Talk to him. Hello, Warden. Hmm. You spark of the familiar. Do I know you, true soul? Hmm. Perhaps not. Your face is rather bland. Thank you. Whatever your business, a warning. None may speak to the prisoners. Disciple Balthazar was most clear. Okay. Um, Disciple Balthazar, not the Warden. Um, right, do we... The gnomes are planning an escape. Do we report that? The rules don't apply no. to me. Detect. Don't report it, because we're going to betray these people. I'll speak to them if I want. Why ban speaking, why ban speaking to prisoners? Do not disrespect me. I'm, I'm a true soul. Uh, well, detect thoughts wouldn't be bad. Wouldn't be bad at all. Just, as long as we don't get caught. There we go. Let's see what she's thinking. We don't do it Mind often enough, honestly. ...with information about the prison. The small levers behind the warden's desk open every cell, while the larger one triggers the alarm. Mm. And interesting items confiscated from prisoners lie above the warden's office, just up the ladder. 
point that fucking handy to know. do it elsewhere. As I said, you are free to roam where you wish, but do not. We'll need to talk to Bath though, I think. Yeah. Um, other tieflings, your own people are in a cell, aren't you bothered? I'm, I wouldn't say that. I'm looking for a particular prisoner, Duke Raven Guard. No, just leave. Mm. Should we just leave and come back to this? I'm gonna say leave for now. I think this is where we should start our massacre and open all the cells so they can all join the fight. When we do have the massacre, do you, do you think we can get up this without? Uh, can't. Oh. No? Yeah, apparently so. This is a restricted oh, area. Okay. Time to explain yourself, or this mm -hmm. guard will be restricting you to a cell. Um. Um. Try to talk your way out of it. Convince them you belong here. Or bribe. <laughs> I'm gonna buy. I mean... I, I'm gonna buy my way in. No, literally, look at the amount of money that would be. It's seven thousand. Or should we you don't have that bribe? much. Try to convince them, or try to take the way out of it. Because let's be honest, we're gonna get caught up here. Try to convince them you belong here. Um, why are you looking at me like that? I live here. Uh, this is my place now. If you leave persuasion, better. Act. Your persuasion would be better. Persuasion. That's what you're best at, right? Yeah. Oh. Ah. Uh, uh, I think we're reloading this, possibly. Yeah. Whatever you last saved, because I'll be honest. Do we want to get attacked by the whole place? Good luck. Oh. You're one below. Fuck. This is not an easy check. Can we even reload? Did you save before we went down the steps? Yeah. I think you did. Alright, well that's all we need then. Well, that's no, not far back at all. Just before, just before. Well, that's fine. Just before going down the steps is fine. We'll just repeat what, like, we have, what, two conversations? Yeah. And even then, we don't even need to probe our thoughts. Because now we know the information anyways. Yeah. All we need to do is maybe eavesdrop on the gnomes, and that'll be it. Yeah. I mean, hell, we don't even necessarily need to do that, but that warhorn bongle need, we, guy? We, we don't even need to speak to the warden? Uh, no, we need to speak to Balthazar. Yeah, whoever the but fuck not, they are. not the warden, so we don't have to even answer but, that conversation. Uh, let again. me show you what I saw. That seems pretty fucking important. Okay. Also, if Minthar is alive... Since that letter up there seems to make it seem like she was, I wonder if she's going to be in the prison somewhere. Why I thought she was yeah, a, a, one, a true follower, a true soul. She or was. Call her. But she failed them, right? Just like all the other guys. Oh, that's that right. Killed. Yeah. So maybe she's down here. Maybe all the other goblins are too. Fair enough. Right. Um, what is it you've seen? I'll show you. You jump over here. This what massive pit here the with blood leading into it. Frig is this? And whatever the fuck just yelled from it. Um, Something just yelled from the pit. Is this the absolute? I don't know. Whatever it is, it looks pretty fucking evil. And look at these goddamn corpses. Yeah. And how many bodies are piled around it. It's where they dump all the people they torture it by the looks of it. I also wanted to check out. And I'm going to have uh, Shadowheart split from me on this. And I'm going to hide and go up. Because I have a feeling that I might be able to stealth my way around. Oh, be careful going up there. In What's case that? they are gonna... Because this might lead to that upper level. I'll continue and if I can exploring. sneak in there and steal shit. I mean, I don't know for sure, but... It's not a bad idea if I stealth ahead first, at least.
Ah, uh, so this little eyeball here is what's called a scrying eye. It's resistant to a lot of damage. So I'd have to destroy it to be able to get up here and not get caught. And then loot everything. Okay. Try. Good luck. Mm. That's all I'm saying. Oh, trust me. I'll need all the luck I can get if I'm actually to do this. Because oh. I have to get a shot on it. And deal like 16 some damage. Yeah. Which, can I just remind, is not easy. No, no. I, I could toss something, like throw a weapon and maybe uh, do more damage, but I'm not positive. And even then, whatever I throw might not come back to me, you oh, know? shit. Yeah. Hmm. The only thing is, though, like, if you kill that orb, like, are they connected to, like, a hive mind? I don't think so. Just be careful. Well, I'm gonna put it on time base mode real quick. Oh, okay. Just so I can make sure I can hit it here. Fair enough. Got it. Good man, right. See what's in that chest. I'll just have to remain crouched up here, though. I had to use my crit to make sure I could do it, but... Right, well, you've got four There's chests. There's a lot of stuff up here. Yeah. Shit on it. Um... I'm just taking anything that looks important, and then I'll look in the chests. Oh, that one's locked. Can you unlock it? Yeah, I got this. Unlocked. The brow beaten circulet. Oh, that's not really that good, but it's something. Well, look, if this stuff's gonna be absolute shit, which hopefully it's. Well, not. I can always sell off any things we find. There's also some invasion plants up here, supposedly. On a map, so that could be, you know, useful. Okay, fair enough. The arrow transportation, arrow of many targets, some gold. Got the third one open. It's just a bunch of potions in that regard. Gold chalice, gold ring, burnished necklace. Although the invasion plans for the Sword Coast could be pretty fucking important. Yeah, although a map of the Sword Coast from the Sea of Moving Ice down to invasion from the Sword Coast. No, not yet. In fact, that might be like crucial information to pass off to people. Okay, yeah, take that. So. Yeah, I'm taking it now. Um, I'm actually not sure if there's anything else important up here. By the looks of it, possibly not. Okay. Hmm. Have you? I mean, I could hop around on top of the cells here and then probably hop into one or two and break people out. Well, well we don't want to but do that, Jacob. Remember, we're disguised. I know. I'm aware of that. And it's best we stay that way, I'm sure. Yep. That's exactly what I was mm. thinking. I do see an area we haven't checked out yet, though. That might not be bad. So I have no look at. Uh, well, let me come down and I'll guide you there.
Alright, I can probably stop stealthing now. Um, where's this area? Give me just a moment. Looking at the map, it's actually right near you. I think you have to jump up to it though. Not there. Where are we jumping Right up to? here. Oh, up here? And this is like a back way, I think. Oh. To, to the back of the cells area. In case, not for us doing it now, but for when we do, maybe break them out. I'm not sure though. Okay. This is weird. Oh, there's more of that fleshy shit. That's cute. Here, there's a a, a, a speedy thing. And then we can climb down into one of that fucking abysses. Wh why would we want to do that? Uh, to possibly figure out what the fuck the answer to everything is? Wait, is that going into the what underdark? Does... I don't know, let's find out. Uh... Uh, Obliate? Uh, Rejuvenating Miasma. Hold up for a moment, let me check what that does. Let's... Animate dead doesn't require a corpse in this area due to lingering necrotic stench. Let's get out of here. Mm. This this seems like endgame thing. This, this seems like we should do this last. Well, I see a hook hallway way up ahead. Yeah, exactly, that's why I'm sort of thinking. Unless she so desperately want to go in, but... Oh, I can see the bottom of the flesh pit down here. Yeah, that's why I'm thinking we should come back to this. <laughs> Holy shit. You know, maybe you're right. <laughs> <coughs> yeah. But I will say, why do I have a feeling that looking at all this flesh, it reminds me of that Nautiloid. Yeah, the Nautiloid ship. That we ship. Flew on in the very, yeah, the Nautiloid in the very beginning. They could have. It has its like same kind of texture almost. They could have um, maybe a Nautiloid ship is underneath the Moonrise Towers, unless they flip and built Moonrise Towers using a freaking well, Nautiloid ship. I mean, honestly, that's possible. Or just harvested the material of it that was buried beneath. Yeah. Oh. There's a boat here? Oh, come here. I guess for when we help the prisoners escape. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Ah, uh, that little back way. No, it's dead end up there, Jacob. And then this is a broken wall that we could break people out to. Uh, but I think we should wait on that. Yeah, we definitely need to wait on that. But, um... Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. We need to talk to Balthazar though, wherever the fuck she is. Yeah, we also need to go and speak to Zarel. Yeah. Or Zell or Both whatever you call her. Zell or whatever. Zarel. Zarel. Zarel, I think. I'd love to get a closer look at, you know, all the prisoners, but... We're not allowed to talk to them, Jacob. I know. That's why. I'm, that's why I said. But we, we will get our chance, Jacob. We're going to talk to whoever the hell we want to talk to. Mm -hmm. And we're not going to let no freaking Gith Yankee warden, warden tell us what to do. Sorry, Tiefling warden. Anyway, shall we head back up into the proper towers now? Don't do it, Jacob! Don't do it! I'm not doing anything right now. I'm just looking at who all is in here. Is Maul in there? I. That's another thing. I don't see Maul in any of this either. Leia. So. Cal. It makes me wonder I'll if there's more prisoners elsewhere because there's no Maul. Damas. I know. And I'll be right alongside you. We won't let them win. Not now, not ever. Okay. 
Well... Actually, wait, there's heavy oak doors right here. There might be more through here. Ooh. I just hit the use button. Okay. What is this? Let's go into a different zone. Docks. Docks. Enjoy the view. This feels like it's stretch all the way to the Sea of Swords in a clear day. If this uh -huh. place hmm. Right, we'll be staring if we look any of these things, so we better not. So, Arden, do you see anything, like, interesting around here? Nope. Ru shipwreck hmm. over there, but you can't get over to it. Not too much out in this section. No. Though it does wrap around to that little cove I mentioned. I with the boat. Yeah. Because it looks like it does. Yeah, it definitely feels like it should. Oh, apparently this is a way to flank around from the town, by the looks of it. Uh, if we right wanted there. to do a go in guns blazing playthrough. No, if we wanted to come into the back way and, you know. No. Sabotage. Interesting. Not this way, is this a dead end? Wonder if anyone <laughs> I do actually plays like a like a full on guns blazing bill. Oh, I'm sure people do. Because I would be I, I, I could do it. I would be infiltrating the Oh, here's the I bottom do. of that cat hole. Oh. Well that's Now we know how that looks. Yeah. Great. Alright, so not much of a secret. Back up to the top, I suppose. Alright, let's let's try and find Zarel or whatever the frick you call her. She's in the second floor. Right now we're in the basement area. Any one of them could be elevated to true soul, should they accept the absolute. Mm. Right. But then I shall have to keep... It's great that we're seen as being true soul, isn't it? Yeah. It's good that they don't know all the people of this we killed outside. Yeah. You know? And it's good that we left nobody alive at the goblin camp to report back. Oh. The thing is, those Zentrum people? Mm. Technically, we did leave them alive because that was the same merchant. Shit. We did meet her once before. But she doesn't remember us, and even if she did, I don't think she'd care. Because they're mercenaries. That's they're right. They're not with the absolute. They're just with the, you know, whoever pays them enough money. That's right. So, how the hell do we get up to the second floor? Is it these stairs? Oh, it is. I believe so. Hmm. So I'm having to step away and check something oh, real no quick. Worries. Just having a poke around. Alright. Oh, so it's up these stairs here? Yeah, up these <clears> stairs here, and we don't have to load into another area, it's all one. Really? Interesting. I know. Great. Moonrise Tower's mm. first floor. Right, there's a locked door there, we'll not open it just yet. Necromites? What? Gaping sockets that see what nothing. The fuck? And still, they seem to. Yes, yeah, so we're not going to the roof. Why are we not going to the roof? Uh, off limits. The goblins. Tell me going how on they suffered. No, better yet, show me. Her mind enters yours abruptly, flickering across your memories in a blaze of excitement. Mm. Tons of psychic flame lap at the memory of the goblins dying by your hand. I see you like to handle underlings physically. So do I. Yeah. Uh, the trial by combat was my idea, just, just saying. I honestly don't know what to say here. Got any more for me to punish? Sounds like being your underling would be quite enjoyable. I don't know if that's sarcastic or not. I'm wasting my time didn't come here to quit. You probably wanted to. What do you think? Um, got any more for me to punish? I'd say one. Plenty. But I hope someone of your talents would be more ambitious. 
You came here to answer the Absolute's call. Let's see what you're made of. She parts the folds of your mind again, touching your wants and hopes, tasting them. Every emotion soaks into her mind's palate. But there is purpose to her exploration. She is searching for proof of your faith. Oh, well, you're fucked. Mm. Excuse you. Well, we don't have any faith. <laughs> but we're actually here to kill the Absolute, not freaking join them. Yeah. The thing is, I don't have good charisma. Or wisdom, per se. I don't want to do as I prepare to attack. Because that's just gonna, you know. I could do number five, maybe. Uh, what's number five? Distracted with drawing. by drawing her to draw hunger for battle. Yeah, sure. Because that's the only thing I have to. I don't have to roll for. Caution. Hesitation. You fear power even when it's offered freely. Would you waste the Absolute's gifts as well? I have already been blessed to stand in her presence. It was bliss. All sorts of she. She gave me everything I mm -hmm. wanted. Show me the power she gave you. Hmm, why not? What's the point in power if you don't get to have a little fun every now and again? She gave me the power to cut the thread of life with a thought. Oh, whoa! Holy shit! But I can caress as well as cut. That's why you should stay on my good side. I like that actually has. The best way to do that back. is to serve General Thorne. I have a mission for you. Oh, a mission? That's it. Play along. The closer you can get to the general, the closer you'll be to the answers you seek. Hmm. I love to serve. What do I need there to do? There is a relic that General Thorne requires. He sent his most trusted advisor, oh. Disciple Balthazar, oh, no. to retrieve it. Oh, the no. relic is beneath the Thorm family mausoleum. Oh! That is where you will find Balthazar. But we oh. have contact with him. Go there. Aid Balthazar if you can. And bring the relic home. Sounds like we should betray Balthazar, in my opinion. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? What if Balthazar is uh, dead? I'm gonna say, you lost contact. What do and you I mean? accompanied him. It was destroyed shortly after he left Moonrise. Hardly a surprise. We're protected here, but outside the shadows are hungry. What happens if Balthazar is dead already? I ask her that and see. What if Balthazar Death is dead? would not silence Balthazar for long. But dead or alive, he is lost. Whatever has become of him, it is the relic that matters. Grand. So if we kill him. What exactly was this relic he was sent to retrieve? It is something that General Thorne designed. Bet it's the night song. And that he has ordered us to retrieve. Probably. That is all you need to know. The shadows around the mausoleum are deep and hungry. You will need a moon lantern to survive. Oh, them. you got one. Take one from Balthazar's chambers. But don't pry. Here, I can get one. The person who snooped into his secrets lost their uh... head. I believe he uses it as a chamber pot. What? What was that? The comment was the last person who snooped in that room lost their head. J Jesus. Uh. Oh! Well, this is interesting. Balthazar has sent neither word nor notice. Where, wherever he's gone is a mystery. Need someone to investigate his chambers, but no doubt he has rigged the thing to high hells. Perhaps have problems. This is Zarel's personal reminder? Well, let's... Zarel? Where is Balthazar's chambers?
Wrong one. Also, I really like whatever the fuck mace she has. Yeah. This uh, Radiger person. Looks really cool. Have you spoken to her yet? Nope. I'll it try. It's not your time yet, blessed one. Oh, you can. The rooftop chapel is reserved for the general's private contemplation. Okay, he's on the rooftop. Save for those he chooses to ascend. This must be the place. We have to get inside. Right, that's how we get mm. inside. I would say three. And how is one chosen to ascend? I'm sure you have done a great many things to get this far, true soul. But above, you will stand in her very presence. Such an honor requires more. Disciples Ra will give you a chance to earn that honor. Right, well, we're not ready. Mm. I don't even want to prove it because we're not ready to go up and see her yet. Let's go to the mausoleum first. Let's go, let's go to the mausoleum first. Well, and work our way up like We should gentlemen. check out that room that was mentioned, I think. Yeah. Is this Balthazar's room, do you think? Oh, is this over here, Balthazar's? That's the rail. Oh, this is Balthazar's room key. Um. What the? I'm gonna close this door? Fuck. Also, I noticed we don't have Kardak or Shadowheart with us. Let's actually group us up so they'll walk in, maybe? Yeah, there's a corpse here. Yeah, that, that's. Um, how do we group oh, up? Oh, they're both. They're both down in the fucking basement still. They didn't jump down that one way, remember? Oh, for God's sake. Yeah. Right, well, let's, let's go bring them. Back up and around. Back up and around. Come I on. was gonna look up if Mathal actually would still be alive down here. Up to She's probably, she she would have been probably in one of those empty cages if she was. Yeah, but I explicitly knocked her out, so I thought she would have showed up down here. Yeah. Or just standing around here somewhere, you know? So, I'm actually going to double check that we definitely quick. sure we didn't kill her. I did, ex I exclusively knocked her out. Hmm. Weird. I mean, maybe it did count as killing her, possibly, but it shouldn't have. It'd be disappointing if it did. Yeah, it would have. Right. All right. Carlac's back. Oh, I. Okay. Yeah. No, Mentor is dead. Dead. Apparently. How do you know? Because no, we had to have knocked her out when she was temporarily hostile, not just hostile. Like, she catches us stealing or something for it to have worked. That was the issue. Oh. So yeah, she's not going to show up at all. Oh well, though. It is what it is, you know? Right, well. Let's, uh... Let's get back up, shall we? Oh, all right. What are these? So, if I may just say, oh, God damn it. oh peshy, make pesh, pesh. Um. Mm. Oh, they're easy enough kills. That was easy. Yeah. Anyway, I was trying to investigate these books. And you got stabbed. Right. Um perhaps these uh. books. Mm. 
Nope, maybe this book? Oh, Jesus! She did warn this place was trapped to high hell, right? Jacob! What kind of frickin' psycho! Booby traps his own bedroom! You know? Like, has he got like a frickin' secret stash of frickin' sex toys somewhere? Like, are these, are these the blow kind of, up dolls hanging from the ceiling? I presume the kind of person who. Would, you know. Booby trap his own bedroom is the same kind that would. Oh, I don't know. Be loyal to a cult of evil. people like this? That is true. Uh, Traveler's chest here. Yeah, is there is there another moon lantern somewhere? Oh, I already picked up one, actually. I was gonna read through the personal notes though that we can see throughout. Hmm. Personal note one. I am evil. Personal note two. Another sex toy delivery ah, arrived yes. from Baldur's Gates. What the fuck? Ah, oh, great, the gas again. I spy with my little eye. Nothing of note, really. I'm afraid it doesn't work like that, Fresh. We're undercover. But rest assured, this whole castle tar thing will be massacred in a later stream. Well, just I just not at the minute. The We're investigating at the minute. The uh, ancient altar. It wants us to insert an item, but what fucking item? Um, I don't know. Let me try. We're gonna have penis. to read the books to figure it out, probably. Yeah, I'll, I'll try my penis. <sighs> the scorch book. Blah 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 blah. blah. To those who doubt me, may the storm claim your final breaths and the earth reject your rest. Ah, nope, nope, not my penis. Attention, acolytes. Permitted entry for the sole purpose of collecting moon lanterns. Library is not to be tampered with. Do not think to read any term on the subject here. So, should you desire information on poisons, do not think to read any term on the subject here. They are inclined to grant more knowledge than written word could provide. So, aka, that'll poison you. Okay. This gets like the other. Uh, I'll ask you that in just a moment. Gotta help. Gotta search the viscera here. There is a clasped book. Log of Bethar's Necromancer's Crested Bone Daughter Day two d has, ten days ago. Has anybody actually used this lever? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna read through this real quick. Oh, the back door's open. Oh, give me a moment. After the state the fallen one was in, I never expected Cressa would be able to save it. I was hoping the use the use of thing would die. That's what it would have wanted. It's not as if Cressa studying it is going to prove much. It was damaged in the attack far beyond what the mere tadpole could do. But she seems fond of the foul creature. Let her play with it. Another entry after. I should not have, in hindsight, let Cress Cressa keep a pet. Ever since it was shipped onto one of the Narloids to be deployed, she has been inconsolable. It won't survive out there. It needs me. It isn't like the others. The feral thing will make a fine warrior for the absolutes. And now my best assistant is just trying to think about it. Pa. She'll come to here again soon enough. Weird. Hmm. Alright, are there any books in here? Um, other than that I haven't read yet. Read, I think you've read Because there's the, there's the personal notes and whatnot, right? I've only read... I haven't read any of them actually yet. Well, I checked out... Note, installer drain... 
Install a drain beneath the library's conventional medicine shelf. It's wasteful to let all that blood seep through the flagstones as it will rust the spikes besides. The line slashes through the above the same hand of fresh ink. Disregard the smell gives me sweet dreams. Hmm. So conventional medicine and then... Well, I think we've got what we came for. We'll cross from the next caravan. Any rocks on Mata Canyon must catch up with Carnivax. No Volo, better a century of ignorance. In Valium, that holds ink like no other. New copy of Swift and Sudden Death for library. Thing is, we need to figure out what to put in this fucking ancient altar, and I have no idea. I'm guessing it's the Night Song. I don't think it, the Night Song would go in there, necessarily. Mm. Well, clear. I mean, maybe we don't have the item at the minute, but I'm sure if we left this snuff film set, maybe we'll find it. Hmm. I'm going to ask Zarel about the strange altar to see if she's, if that's even an option. I already gave orders to your companions. Find the necromancer Balthazar. I spoke slowly, so why are you here instead of out there looking for him? Okay, she's angry. What is she saying? Oh, she's just, why am I st standing there asking questions when we're not out there looking for him? Mm. I th she's a bit impatient. I can't wait to kill her, however, I also don't want my head to explode. Oh, I'm gonna... Just try putting in a few items here. I'm gonna try putting in a human heart. We found several of those throughout the room, right? Yeah. Hm. Oh! Well, I'll be damned! Good, Matt. Je Jeepers, well. Anything. Let me unlock it. A uh, cold brim hat and an elixir of whatever that was. Once returned, any condition inflicted on target also applies to times of encrusted with frost. Whatever that does. The necromancer was experimenting on the tadpoles. Well, it's literally a witch's oh! hat. Oh! imbued with Netherese magic. So where did that magic come from? What? A goblet filled with the mutilated corpses of illithid parasites. What? Whatever ungodly experiments. This person was trying to reverse engineer, seemingly. Them. A dead pixie? What? I don't know. This is. Um... Are you reading? Are you reading the notes there? No. Is there... Let me look at his research notes real quick. Because there's a thing that says combined there on the table. I've redirected some materials from beneath the tower. I plan to simply raise what forces I need inside the mausoleum itself. But the general prefers that no more of his family crits be disturbed. Mm. Even so, I may have no choice. The temple will not surrender the night song easily. So that's what's down there, the artifact, the night song. And the general's invulnerability depends on it. I am sure he will forgive a little transgression if it frees the army to move on Baldur's Gate at last. Right. So the night song is what's keeping him alive? Well, the mausoleum is very, very clearly where they're keeping the night song. 
Or were they still trying to retrieve it, actually, by the sounds of it? Aye, but there's a big demon devil thing that Raphael doesn't like underneath the mausoleum. Yeah, which might be the night song, maybe. That's true. Well, I don't know what to combine here, because it's uh, something about the moon lanterns. Looks like it was used in the crafting of moon lanterns. I guess I have to hold a moon lantern. I don't even know how that would work. Honestly, I'm gonna presume I don't need to put anything in it, right? Uh, Although, from what I can tell, whoever this Balthazar guy was, seems to be the one who might have made Catherick immortal. To some degree, too. Because he seems like a fucking hell of a necromancer. He also sounds powerful as well. To say the least. I and mean, he also sounds like he's going to be a bastard to kill. Yeah. Definitely. So... I guess our task now is to go... To the mausoleum? Yeah. Hmm. Do you think we need to buy any supplies or anything before we go? Or? I don't think so. Maybe, maybe actually, hang on. Let me heal myself here, actually. There we go. Mm. I'll actually heal all of us with a prayer of healing real quick. Lovely. So, this seems to be most of everything that we have to explore for now. How come I, I do... only have 68 health points? Karlak has oh, 85 a... hit points and you have 87 hit points? What? what, what? I have a... I have a lot of points put into constitution, which is what like gives me more health. Plus, the uh, armor I picked up gives me more constitution as well. But I've got the adamantine armor. Yes, that's not constitution though. Oh, what's that? I have a I have a con of eighteen right now. Oh. What is your con stat? Where do you see that? Uh, open up your character sheet. It's on the right side. Beneath your like fourteen your levels and stuff. Well, that's why I I get an extra two health each level compared to you. Oh wow! Can I not level up that Plus, I, as we go? I also have. Well, you can. You just have to put points into it with your ASI and whatnot. Fair enough. But uh, yeah, as it stands now, I think what we have to do is go into that mausoleum. We've explored everything we can topside for now. Yeah. That's. Doesn't fill me with much confidence. Same here, but oh, what else are we to do? We killed all of this. Oh, hang on, I'm, I'm lost. Here. Hang on, where where did you go? Oh, I just started going north. Oh right, okay, hang on, wait for me. There we go. Is there any last-minute supplies you think we need from camp or anything? I don't think so. Because I have a feeling once we go in here, it might be like that uh, Gith Yankee crash where we can't where we can't save possibly. But that's just a guess. Um, I think we're okay. I I haven't used up any of my spell slots yet, so. And Shadowheart only used a singular one. So. Yeah. All right. There goes nothing. Well, I think we have to we have to say it, Jacob, we have to say it. Alright. Certainty Three. of death. Oh, certainty of death. Small chance Small of success. Small chance of success. What the fuck are we what waiting for? What the fuck are we waiting for? Right, well we've already looted this place. Not all of it. This back bit we still have to Yeah, we avoided this back bit. 
And this says... Elg Olaf. Whatever the fuck that Isabel means. Isabel Sarcophagus. Step carefully. There's a trap. Catholic thorn leading Shah's forces. Quite um, about face for a warrior of Saluna. Um, Let me just... You know. Disarm these little traps here before we set them off. Might not be the time. Maybe not. Might not be the time. Catherick Thorn leading hmm. sharp. Might not Next be the time. Next time's the charm. Trap. Be cautious. I think we need to have someone step on the plates while we do it, maybe. Unless you found another button. Right. Now we'll try hitting the button. Maybe this place not. is hungry for blood. All right, how do we actually do this? There's then? two plates. Yes, I was standing on either one of them. Catholic Thorn leading Shah's forces. Quite the about face for a warrior of Saluna. I'll have to try this. Rick Thorn and his dark justicias. Now there's a fall from grace for the history books. Right. Thorn Shah's this place is trapped. Quite so there's got to be a way to do it. The question is how. What's the locking mechanism? I wonder. Watch how you go. Oh, there's buttons under each of the little mules. Do we have to activate all of them? Also, I have so many things to fucking disarm. Nothing's getting set off yet, but it will be soon, I'm sure. Quite the about face for a warrior of Saluna. That's going red. Ah, uh, maybe because we do that in the wrong order there. What the fuck is shooting? That's not going to work. There's Moonrise. Alright, so... I think I'm figuring it out slowly. I think I have to hit this one next. All right, hit that first one there. Right. I've hit Catherick Thorns one. All right, and then we hit this next one over here, because this one comes second. Seems to be some type of like order that we have to do on this specifically. And then. So we hit this. Then we go find the next mule, presuming there's a th another one somewhere. Not Moonrise, then? No, Moonrise lit up, lead, lit up red when I did that. <clears throat> so I'm going to see if there's any other mules around here. Do you not mean a Muriel? To me, it's Mada. <laughs> um... Oh, just got an updated. So, yeah, I'm still at a little bit of a loss. Nope. Let me guess, you just tried that one? I tried it just in case. Ca I tried it just in case because I could have pressed the button instead. That bright tower. It's moonrise. Alright, so what it used to be. Oh okay. Moonrise. Oh no, that hmm. button's Alright, let's try Moonrise again. Then let's try This front one? The general, yeah. And then let's try 
the warning. Nope. So it's definitely a code of some kind. And we Is probably could no... figure out if we read his journals, but honestly, I don't have I don't have them on me at the moment. Hmm. So we go in the morning into tower and then the journal. Hmm. Nope. The only order we haven't tried it in is General Moon Eyes and then, I guess, the morning. Right? Yeah. Alright, there's got to be something that we're doing wrong. I mean, there is a, there is a plaque in the middle of the grave. That says Susun Elg Oloth. Susun Elg Oloth. Which means fuck ye. Who the fuck knows? Was that it? Did we do it? Uh I don't know. I think I might have just destroyed all the traps, honestly. Catherick Thorn leading Shah's forces. Quite the about face for a warrior of Saluna. Wow. That bright tower. It's moonrise. Or it used to be. I don't fucking know. Well, Catherick Thorn. Bowed by grief for his daughter. From what I know, I think it would go Moonrise, then Grief, and then Shaw. That's how it chronologically went, I think. Oh! There we go! We did a thing! I had to remember his story, but I got it. Also, definitely like safe now. That's cute. But hey, all it did was re recounting his history, which. I forgot for like a solid 15 fucking minutes there. Yeah. It's, uh... Because originally he was a follower of Saloon, then he lost his wife, then he turned to Shah. Well, not his wife, maybe his child. And then also tried to turn into necromancy. Alright, here we go. Okay. This is definitely not... <laughs> this is down to the Temple of Shah, by the scenes of it. The Gauntlet of Shah. Oh fuck, they had to use the word Gauntlet, didn't they? By the design. You know, what? why do I have the feeling that once we go in here... Yeah, it's gonna be a real big fucking thing, so to say. Yeah. I get the impression. Because this will be the other side of that Sean Temple city area that was blocked off. You know, the one that was battered by a fucking devil. Shah, Here's a plaque. Singer of eternal night. Protector of the lost and forgotten. Cross but from light into can darkness. Can we just appreciate the fact that your Levin Catherick Throm has had this under his grave? Offer your pain to Shah's Yeah. Enemies. Hear the night song. Oh, can I just say, if we find the Night Song, do you mind if I do this with Shadowheart? Yeah, sure. Shah's warriors must not the answer lies As long as darkness. I can talk to the Absolute when the time comes. Only loss awaits the Absolute. Whoa! Is that what Shah's the that? Who speaks? The Dark Lady's path lies in darkness. Perhaps that is how I can pursue it. Well. Mm. You know... What 
Hmm. Can I walk around the outskirts? Looks like it. Beware. This place is trapped. You already saved, right? Oh, I. Good. Should we go through here? Don't go through any doors quite yet. Traps and all, you know. Yes, traps, Jacob. Step carefully. There's a trap. I don't think you should have went out of that, but all right. I don't even know what trap I sent off. I didn't see one at all. Ah, it's a fucking plate. Jacob, would you mind if I have a go at lock packing? Uh, I mean, if you want to, if you have the resources. Right tool. Okay. Oh. Yep. Pass the flying colors. Well, I just want found a way to lower some of the lanterns here. To do what? To lower some lanterns there. I don't know what effect that'll have, but it might be important. Yep, did bugger all, Jacob. What the hell was that? Well, I haven't loaded all of them. Well, I've just opened the bulky door. Uh, we'll check out where that goes in a moment. I think lowering all these lamps, though, might be important. Emphasis on might be? Hells was that? This will be fun. <laughs> Don't get too close to it, please. No, I won't. Although I assume it's... Oh. I assume it's these yeah, levers. It is. Trap. Be cautious. And also, let me, you know, disarm the pressure plates. Don't run into this one yet. It's a trap. What is they? What are these? You keep stepping on pressure plates, and it keeps releasing this gas from the vents that's obscuring our sight. Although I'm not getting them. Beware. That's because you don't have a good enough perception for them. Is that all of the lanterns lowered? Well, hold up for a moment. Don't go to the sensor quite yet. I, if that's Charles speaking, I might need to try to hop for it. This gas is really annoying. Oh, trust me, I know. So what I think we need to do... Well, one, I need to break the fucking clouds. Yeah. And then, now that we have all these lanterns lowered, let's turn them all off. Because I have a feeling that's going to somehow guide us or something. I mean, the god's about darkness, right? It would only make sense. Yeah, that that would make sense. Oh! Alright. Be more careful. There must be a way around the ring. Well, Jacob, mm. your plan worked. Alright, so I have one of those lights on. Do you want me to turn all the lights on? Alright. No, keep them off. There, maybe this is how we undo most of it and then we do the rest of it somewhere else. 
I don't know, there's loads of these ruins. Well, we haven't gone through these, like, side areas I yet. I it might be important. I, I've got the other side unlocked as well, so... Because well. this is a plaque right here, right? The rain of night comes in a thousand falling leaves. Maybe later. Hmm. There's nothing else out of here. Weird. Let's walk around the edge, see if there's anything in that other side you opened up. Some more of that lovely, delicious gas. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's doing a shitload of damage to us. I just realized. Let's step the fuck out of it and heal. I need healing. Yeah. Because holy shit. I didn't realize that was doing any damage to us. I think you might need to get Shadow Heart to heal as well. In darkness, beauty is equal and wealth unseen. So... It looks like there's a place to poke around up back here. I don't know where this will lead though. Looks like some underdark shit. It does, doesn't it? We in the underdark? Maybe this is the way around? Well, remember, the this was connected to the Grimforge, which is part of the underdark. We just couldn't actually reach it, is all. I smell a trap. The fuck is a cloaker? I think that's <laughs> Um I don't like this. <laughs> no. And it has a hundred and five health. Hmm. Wanna dance? All right. Come on, Karlak, down you get. Toast, toast. I think a wee enragement will be do will uh Right, misty step. I don't think we need to fight the phantasms. Probably just this thing that casts them. The uh, cloaker. This thing. Yeah. The non-transparent one. A lot of damage. Almost dead. There we go. Hmm. Those will do an opportunity attack. What the 
fuck is a moan? We good. A lot of damage. There we go. Is he dead? Yep. Lovely that jumper. chest had some basic loot in it and then a crystalline lens, which I'm not sure what that'll be used for, but something probably in a puzzle in this, I bet. Oh, damn. I'm done. I can't wait to sleep. Oh. A lot of mushrooms. And chattering. Mice. Observe rat's behavior. Abandoned journal? Lady Shaw continues to preserve me, though escape is impossible. The beast still prowls our halls, though the sounds of battle no longer reach my ears. I fear all brothers and sisters have fallen in defense of the Night Singer's sacred gauntlet. But I shall wait. The beast will not linger for long, surely. The beast still remains. Why does it not just leave? Why does it sing? The food is gone. I must preserve, preserve my strength. Mistress, embrace me, please. Hmm. So this guy starved to death down here. This dog, dog just is here. Well, these rats are guarding this sarcophagus. Oh, I'm in a cutscene. Religion, pray at the altar. Pesh. Oh well. Seriously? I'm gonna re rule again. Okay. Pesh! <sighs> I'm gonna rule again. One last time. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I wouldn't bother with it anymore. Here, do you want to go? Your silent gesture vanishes into a pitiless, dark void. Your heart aches faintly with an inexplicable Here, is that a shrine to saloons? No. A shrine to Shah. Is that not who Shadowheart worships? Place of offering to the dark. Oh, I have Shadow Heart here with me. May she embrace the entire world. God be in my prayer, Shadow Heart. Nope. Okay. Got it. Nice one. A pleasurable shiver runs down your spine. You feel as if you've unburdened a troubling thought and forgotten it forever. So I have the Night Singer's favor, you have, and you're Shaw stricken. Congrats. What's that mean? No idea. Why am I bent over like that? What's that above my head? Jacob? Oh, that's an effect on you at the moment. Go to your character sheet and look at your cha characteristics. Because I have the Night Singer's fa favor, right? So affected entity is resistant to necrotic damage until your next long rest. Which probably means I should do that for Shadowheart. Thinking about it. Yeah, and how do you find out this... ...conditions, is it? Huh. <sighs> Shh. 
shower no, stricken. Just... The lady of loss hexes you, causing temporary lapse in your agility. For fuck's sake. Ah, uh, that's not too important. You're lying heavy on that. Wait a moment. What? Uh, uh, skeleton's here. I'm dead. Right. Now, the thing is, Jacob, we are slightly out not of time. Are we? Yeah. But let's talk to these skeletons um, first. Sure. <laughs> you prowl my battleground. Why? Are you friend? Foe? Thieving scavenger? Mm. You find yourself in a dead, putrid skull, oh. somehow hosting a tadpole amongst a squirm of maggots. Right? Another presence lurks within, manipulating the corpse like a puppet. Ah, a friend. An uninvited friend. Balthazar is speaking to the undead. Is that Balthazar? Zarel Balthazar is speaking through the undead. He's controlling them from far. Did she now? Enter. I will see if I have any use for you. Hmm. Stinking pile of ogre afterbath! What? The quake herald the shadows. They found me. What? I don't know what he's talking about. Oh, I'm guessing hell spawn. What, what, because what? Because Owl Siege, the original temple. I don't know. Oh? What is that? Oh! Old Dark Just to See Us. It's the animated armor by the looks of it. Oh, Just to See Avenger? Oh, I guess I'm going to be in a bit of a fight for now. like this, mate. Oh, they're easy enough. I think more will spawn from the portals if I have to guess. Because we can't target them. Oh, never mind. I guess we can. Well, the corpses are useful. <laughs> they don't have any targets right now, is all. I wonder if those things are actually going to spawn any more foes. I don't know, if we can get rid of them, they might not. Oh, yep, yeah, there's one. Oh, yeah. Misty step. Don't bloody have misty step. Why do I not have misty step? You don't have it infinitely. It comes to one of the items you're wearing, right? An amulet? Yeah. You can only use it so many times, I imagine. Breathe deep and move. I 
Ah. Start your turn. I know I'm figuring out my movements here. Give him a pommel strike. There we go. Did bugger all, but. I decided I wouldn't waste a rape on this fight. Didn't seem like I needed to. Fair enough. I've got it. Only have this one enemy over here left, so. Oh, more portal spawn? Didn't see those ones over there. Oh, you're joking me. Portals certainly have spawned. Yeah. Um. Bash. Was what that? the fuck? What? Okay, I might have to rage now. Yeah! Cause that guy has 150 what health. Saying. <laughs> yeah, and he's very easy to miss as well, apparently. Even though he's massive. Pesh. Pesh. 
<laughs> We're not dent on these enemies. I might actually just ignore the dark justiciers for now and just head straight to the portals. After we defeat the big guy. Hmm. Oh, that's what you think is best. Shout out, just gonna be fucking beat. Yeah, I can see that. It's a um, lot of fucking enemies here. Ready for this. Right, I would go for the portals. Understood. Oh, they can't be blinded? Damn. Well... <laughs> we have one more portal. I've just realized I have a severe buff at the moment. Not buff, nerf. How bad's your nerf? Well, this stupid hex shards put on me. What is his effects on you? Um, agility, I think. And I've noticed my attacks aren't as strong. Oh no, that's not from the prayer thing. These guys are resistant to oh, pretty much every damage but Radiant. I'm not kidding you. I've checked. Seriously? That's why it's so fucking tough to actually do any damage to him, yeah. Because I noticed all my attacks weren't doing much either, so I double checked. It's like, oh! Hmm. Bullshit. Oh, about bloody time. Oh, Jesus! Um, that's not Baltazar, is it? No. Uh... But, uh...
Uh, Vaz. What? Darth is uh, here at the altar. Ah, the oh. interloper. And in one piece as well. Jesus Christ. Not just any true soul would have succeeded in following my path. What is wrong with his face? You should be pleased. He's an evil necromancer. He's fucked with himself a lot. Baltazar, I presume. Zarel sent me. She thinks you're in danger of failing your master. No. I fought a battle right under your nose. Help would have been useful. True soul, bold of you to assume I'm a comrade. I am pleased when I separate your head from your shoulders. Uh, not yet. Not tr uh. General Thorn. Rubbish. Everything is at hand here. Zarel merely envies the General's faith in me. I am in the midst of a grand strategy. But you're here now, and I may be able to put those limbs to work. You know what's at stake here. I take it. The name Balthazar yeah. seems familiar, but I'm not but not as a servant of Where have I heard where have you heard it before? Might as well try history. Yeah. See if you get the lucky roll. Oh my rolls are terrible tonight. Damn. Oh the thought eludes you. Perhaps he saw a passing reference in some old tome. Um, let's enlighten There is a relic here. One which General Thorn desires. No, needs. I will retrieve it for him, and you will help me. Ignorant you may be, You've shown some prowess in scouting and combat by making it this far. So you need my help? What would I have to do? Why would this relic is so important? What does he do? Should we try persuasion? Well, it's up to you. Well, I'm quite good at persuasion, so... Yep, there we go. Finally. if it'll spare me your bleating. The relic lends the general his strength, his invulnerability. It must be recovered before his enemies attempt to exploit it. I do not help. need you or your help, but you are here in spite of that, so I may as well make use of you. The relic is close. But the way is barred, and Shah's dead are uncooperative. Clear the path for me by blade, cunning, or whatever it takes. I will remain here until you have succeeded, or fallen. Um. Um. Let's try this. Oh, Pesh. That yeah, was worth a try. You know, being here. Well, out of curiosity's sake. Not. It was mentioned you that the uh, court couldn't reach him anymore, to right? Uh huh. Well protected. In, In theory, place. we might be able to kill him down here and they wouldn't know. That's... At least that's what I'm betting now. Yeah. I I think we should so, use him first and then kill him. Mm, when when his when his usefulness has run out. Do not fail me. If you do, and one more two try to actually fight him back. My creations and be forced to try again. Because think about it this way: while he might expend some resources in this. We will expend a lot more too, as well. The further we go in, because I imagine we're not going to fight. Just what we fought now, and that'd be it. Yeah. Oh, I would say there's loads. Uh, I imagine if we are to kill him, now might be our best chance. Maybe. In, in and around all his followers. I say yeah. that because there's only overall there's not that many followers in this room. There's two, three ghouls, the big flesh thing, and him. 
I versus know. the seven sum he had outside he has outside. And if we kill him, I imagine everything he summoned will die. Right? Yes, right. Well, tell you what, we'll sleep on it for a week. And and I think this would be a good place to um, <gasps> leave off. Yeah. Um what? I agree with that. What happened? I'm looking at this uh, lock picking check over here. Yeah. You want to guess the difficulty class for it? I'm guessing it's not twaddly. Uh, I need to get 30. What? <laughs> I have a modifier of 10 to 13. So unless I get like... Basically, unless I get a 20, I don't think I can get it. I'm going to roll once, just like... I got it! Right, what's in here? <laughs> I don't know. Chests. I actually didn't think I'd get that on the first try. Um, teachings of loss and the start. Sixty-six gold, a jade, elixir of battle mages, par, diluted oil sharpness, elixir of heroism, scroll of dark vision, scroll of panic. Yep. I got some infernal iron, Ooh. so we can complete that hell dusk set. And some gold, but that was about it. Lovely. Well. Oh, and a callous glow ring of some kind. Well. So. Um. So, are we agreed that when we resume this game, we are going to? When we get, resume, we'll make our decision. We'll make our decision, and we will potentially kill Baltazar. And on that terrible disappointment, um, for him. Uh, it is time to end. Thank you so much for watching. And we will be back with Baldur's Gate next Thursday. And on Tuesday, we are doing Sea of Thieves. Tuesday, Jacob. Just, just saying. Oh no, the travesty. Yeah, I know, the travesty. But other than that, <laughs> we will uh, we will see you then. Uh, see you later, guys. Say goodbye, Jacob. Adios, everybody. See you in the next one. See you later, guys. Bye-bye now. At once.